So fuzz pedals. They can be divisive. A lot of people don't like them. A lot of people love them. Some hate certain types of fuzz. There's a ton of different variants. I've never personally found one that I super gel with. I always try them out for a little while, do some stuff, get some cool sounds, then eh, it's not for me. Sell it off, try something else. With this abominable electronics, Hail Satan Deluxe, I think I've finally found something really special that I really like. This thing gets an instant doom metal tone that is just thick and nasty and mean, and I love it. Now, Abominable Electronics, it's just one guy and he does small batch builds of these. So you gotta kinda just stay vigilant, get lucky enough to pick one up. If if you do, that's awesome. If not, you're gonna have to wait till he posts them next time. I missed a couple of times, finally managed to get my hands on one, and I'm so glad I did. Now, the Hail Satan Deluxe is a Big Muff style pedal, but with some mods that Big Muff users have been asking for forever. Now it has the normal controls that you'd find, it has dirt, which is the overall volume, as a tone control, and it has the sustain, which is the overall compression, distortion, nastiness of the pedal. But some things that it has that other people have been wanting for years as a blend control that allows you to blend in your dry signal, which is real good for bass players, and you can get some really cool bass tones out of this thing. I think the most important thing this pedal has is a dedicated mid control. Absolutely, absolutely. Mids are the most important thing to a guitar sound, and Big Muff pedals are always so scooped. So being able to dial in and out mids is a godsend. It has a high-end control, so you can dial in or out exactly how much high-end you want, really tailored to the guitar and speaker combo that you're using. Now it has his Hail Satan mode, and it also has a switchable Russian mode. It has a buffer switch, so you can go between buffer and unbuffered. And the switch on the right activates some LED diodes that are in the distortion circuit. And these are pretty cool because they make everything just turn to big, ridiculous, fuzzy mayhem. And when you play, the uh, goat's eyes on the pedal actually light up and respond to your playing. It's pretty awesome. This thing for me also really shines when you hit it with like a Tube Screamer style boost. Like it really saturates more, it tightens it up just slightly, just creates this super thick doom metal sound. And I can't emphasize enough how much I love that with this thing. So we just heard that in a mix. We're gonna hear it outside of a mix. I'm gonna play with all the different knobs and features. At one point, I'm gonna turn on my plumes overdrive so you can hear how it hits the front. Let's just check it out.
So yeah, this thing is a monster. I love it. This one's actually going to stick around. I'm happy to finally find a fuzz that I really gel with. I'm gonna have a link down to Abominable Electronics down below. They have a ton of different options for different fuzz and distortion pedals, all with his cool and unique takes on them. Definitely worth a look. Thanks for watching. Stay metal.